Morning guys, it's about uh, 5.30 a.m. And look, my lovely assistant Willow is joining us today to help assemble <laughs> the, tu the tub or the frame for Rusty the Snowcat. So let's get started.
guys. I feel really good about this because it uh, feels like we're moving forward instead of backwards. Got everything loaded onto the frame or onto the uh, gladiator table. I did some touch up. I see another spot right there I missed. Hang on a second. Okay, as I was saying before, I was so rudely interrupted by spots that I missed when I was... Oh my God, is that another one? What the heck? Okay. I think... I got the majority of them anyway. We're going to let this dry for a few days because it is still kind of gummy. Um, what I've noticed about the oil-based paint is it takes about seven days to dry, but once it does that, the stuff is like bulletproof it's like line x um yeah i'm so happy that this part is done it makes me feel like we're moving forward instead of backwards so much uh i greased up the uh see the frame rails here i greased those up for the uh, track tensioners um the tolerances on these are not perfect so these track tensioners are very angry they don't want to go in any further, but they want to come out all the way. So there's a fabulous Willow. Hi. Thanks for helping today, Willow. This was an awesome project to be able to uh, get this part done. Yeah, you bet. It was fun. It's always fun. But uh, gain some space in the garage here. Move stuff around. Got the OC12 sitting over here in the corner. Got the Isuzu. 4BD2T sitting over here. I'm excited about uh, doing the rebuild on this. I've been reading through the uh, technical manual on it and it uh, doesn't look too bad. I've built a couple, several Subaru motors in my time, so it shouldn't be a big deal. This looks a lot simpler than a Subaru motor, so. But I think that's gonna be it for today's episode, guys. If you like this episode, Give me a thumbs up. If you, for a run, love you, bye. Well, it's going for a run. Uh, if you're not subscribed yet, I'd love to have you, have you as a subscriber. But as always, take care, guys. We'll catch you next time. See you later. Bye-bye.